What's going on Sneaker Talk family? Welcome back to a brand new Nike LA vlog. Now yesterday I went to the Nike LA store in Dixie LA Mall, Ontario, Canada and I uh, went to the Full Locker outlet. So if you guys want to see the Full Locker outlet, check out yesterday's or the last video I uploaded. Check that video out. But today we're going to be going over to I think Winners and I think Puma outlet and then of course the Nike clearance store. Now I'm hyped for this Nike clearance store. This is probably one of the better ones in Canada. So uh, yeah, let's get going. Oh and by the way, I know the Bapesta sneaker giveaway, that Bapesta sneaker giveaway that we did for the month of uh, June, that's announced in the last video. So check that video out, see if you won the free Bapestas. And this month we're actually giving away a uh, free pair of Air Jordan 1 Gym Reds in a size 11. So if you want to enter this giveaway, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel, subscribe to my second channel, my sneaker review channel, Sneaker Talk 365. Follow me on Instagram at SneakerTalkCA and stick around to the end of the video so you guys can enter in the comment section down below. Below. With that said, let's get going to the outlet. First things first, before we get to the shoes, check this out. I found like this Atari shirt right here in a few different sizes, so they got a medium for me. I think I'll probably buy this. And if you guys don't know, Atari is like one of the OG video game consoles in the game. And I don't know if they're still making games right now, but I remember they made a few games for the Game Boy Advance as well. I remember playing the, uh, I think it was like the Duel Masters card game on Game Boy Advance. A lot of fun. And I like the color scheme to the shirt. It's like this yellow, orange, and red in the background. And the Atari navy blue with the Japanese hits. I like it. Very simple. 13 bucks. I think I caught this. This isn't too bad at all. Alright, so now we're going to check out the sneaker section here at Winners. And I actually bumped into an employee here too. So shout out to him at Dixie Outlet Mall. Pretty cool bumping into employees here. But uh, yeah, let's get into these sneakers right now. Starting off with the smaller sizes, the very first thing I see are some Adidas Alpha Bounce right here. This is size six and a half. Really, really small size. It has this like gray, it has this like white speckling on the upper of the shoe right here on this mesh. And uh, how much are these going for? These are going for $60. $60 Canadian plus tax for these. And well, 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 what do we have here? Finders, keepers, we have the Adidas Young 96. And it looks like they have a ton of different sizes. And these are like the perfect colorway for summer. Oh my gosh, I love it, I love it. It's like this fruit punch colorway, I wanna say. It's got hits of this red, orange, a sort of light purple, blue, black suede on the sides right here. White mesh on the upper. This shoe definitely screams summer vibes and it looks like they have a ton of different sizes here as well. Like, take a look at all these pairs. This is a lot of pairs for just one shoe at winter. These are going for $69. 99 Canadian plus tech. Yeah, what do you guys think? Is this a copper drop? Hit that pole in the top right hand corner. So first things first, we're at the training section in the Puma outlet and uh, check it out. They have a ton of shoes here that look like they have the like Adidas Boost technology, but I believe it's called Energy by Puma. And uh, it really looks like Boost. Like this is the exact same cushioning feeling it gives you when you take a step in it. And uh, yeah, so these are the Energy Neko Future going for 80 Canadian dollars. Reminds me of almost like a Pharrell Human Race tennis shoe, but with a more running shoe like aesthetic with this clean cream upper and then uh, they also have a green one here these are the energy neko retro and i mean for for eighty dollars eighty dollars canadian that's not that bad for a very comfortable sneaker like this so I'll throw that back right now they also have the energy neko retro in this red colorway it really reminds me of you know that classic puma suede with that red upper but this time it's in a running shoe version with that full energy midsole sixty dollars canadian not too bad at all What the heck? So these are the Future Runner Premiums, the Puma Future Runner Premiums, and it really looks like a, a Puma RSO became a running shoe right here, like a real running shoe. The Puma RSO is more of a lifestyle sneaker, but this right here has that same little midsole portion the RSOs have, along with the, uh, the Puma logo here on the side, and even these. I'm pretty sure these small little details right here by the laces are even on the RSOs, so cool to see. Oh, even the back. Yeah, this is basically the running shoe version of the Puma RSOs. These are $50. This is another colorway they have as well. A white, navy, blue, and red one with a little bit of dirt on the midsole. So it's got that distressed look going on. And the final sneaker on the regular wall, I'll show you guys before going to the hash wall, are the Puma Cell Descend Shift. And it looks like a uh, budget level Puma running shoe right here with their new cell technology 
which is very, very comfortable. It's a very cushiony, gel-like feeling. I really like this. I had it on the basketball model they released earlier. And uh, yeah, it's not too bad. $69.99 for the Puma Cell Descend Shift. All right, next up, we're at the hash wall, the back hash wall, where a lot of the sneakers are 50% off or more. My mom shopping over here. I think we're gonna shop at the Nike outlet together later, but I'll show you guys some of the best stuff that they have here, starting off with the Puma Sugi Jun. They have an absolute ton of these sitting here, a bunch of sizes in this red and black colorway. The retail price is 170 Canadian dollars, and now they're going for 58 99 that's a hundred and ten dollars off the puma sugi juns right here a really solid pickup and for the 50th anniversary of the puma suede puma released a ton of different colorways collaborations of the puma suede last year and uh, this is one of them that they did this golden version right here and retail price was 150 now they're going for 42.99 that is some really solid savings as well Ooh, for my soccer fans out there check it out they got the puma spirit fg regularly 50 bucks now now $18.99, pretty solid entry level Puma soccer fee right here. That's not too bad, 20 bucks. Next up we have a size 9.5 Puma Spirit IT. This looks like to be an indoor soccer shoe and these are going for $16. So today we're gonna to start off in the size 15 and up section right here, showing some love to all my big footers. And uh, they have a ton of these like Nike soccer shoes right here at the Nike clearance store. These are the Nike Premier 2 FG. And they have like 15 to 20 pairs of these in sizes 13 and up. They're all red. And these are going for $60 Canadian, down from 145. That's about $95 off for these right here, the Nike Premier 2 FGs. These are going for a really good price as well. The Nike Hirachi EDGE Text Quick Strike. The Edge Text Quick Strike for $50 Canadian, down from 150. Really good sale on these. It's like a Miami Dolphins colorway, is that the right term? And it looks like they also have these in size nine as well. So if you come to your Nike clearance store, they might have your size. Check it out, 50 bucks. Now we're on to the smaller sizes, starting around the size eight section. These are the Air Max Plus and X. We've seen these before at the Vaughn Mills outlet with the massive TN Air branding on the side. These are $95, down from 225. This blue colorway, not really feeling these, but for $100, it's a pretty solid price point air max 270 fly nets for 160 down from 230 dollars and uh, we actually saw a pair of these in a different colorway for 80 dollars at the Foot Locker outlet so if you guys haven't seen my Foot Locker outlet check it out click it in the top right hand corner of your screen right now or just uh, watch it after this but we found air max 270 fly nets for 80 bucks at the Foot Locker outlet these ones here are double the price 160 but in a uh, very very solid colorway pretty cool for summer these aren't very ideal for summer but these are going for 60 dollars down for 145 Five. These are the Air Force One high with that like woodland camouflage upper right there. It's not all over like the Air Force One low. Pretty surprising they decided to do this with the color blocking on the highs. I would have preferred it to be all woodland camo, but I'm not even going to buy these anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But uh, yeah, these are going for again 60 Canadian dollars for these Air Force One. We got some American football cleats right here. These are the Vapor Untouchable 3 Elite. Now these retail for $260. Now they're going for just $100. $100 for these high top, I guess, American football cleats right here. All flying at upper. These will become green after one game, that is for sure. I've been seeing a few of these pairs laying around the Nike clearance store today in a few different sizes. These are the Air Maestro 2 LTDs going for $75, down from $190. Really bulky retro throwback vibe right here. These are definitely not ideal for the summer weather at all, but these are going for 50 bucks. So if you want to buy these now and hold them for the fall and winter, ooh, these even have like a Sherpa lining on the inside to keep your feet nice and toasty and cozy. That's pretty cool, but yeah, $50 for these mid-top Nike SFAF ones with that umbilical cord. I always like to call it the umbilical cord. I forget what it's called. The para, para jumper cord? Para jumper cord? I don't know. But uh, yeah, 50 bucks for these. These are weird. These are the Nike Air Torreira Humara 18s for $35. Not a fan of these. These are like the other Humaros we saw at the Full Locker outlet, but 
much cheaper and a uh, completely different color scheme. This is more earth toned compared to those bold bright colors of the other hiking shoes. Next up we got some Air Max 180s going for $75 down from 190 with this like earth tone upper. We got the brown, we got this sort of tan sand color scheme. We have this sort of peachy kind of swoosh, a pink swoosh. Oh, it comes with extra laces. That's pretty nice, but uh, that's pretty solid. $75 for a pretty nice pair of Air Max 180s. Now I'm not really a fan of the Air Max 180, but if this is your style the shoe and you dig it that $75 price point is definitely very very appealing Now we're digging through the size 9 section with what might be one of the best finds of the day. We have the Nike Air Max 1 in this navy blue upper in a sail midsole, sail swoosh, and the retail price was $145. Now it's dropped down to $59.99. $60 plus tax for this really clean colorway of the Air Max 1s. And if you're a fan of the Nike Roshi 1, they have these in a ton of different sizes. This is like a South Beach colorway they have with the pink swoosh. They got the teal collar, the teal laces, very summery kind of vibes. Not my kind of shoe. I definitely would not see me wearing this, but for $45, that's a good come up right there. These might be one of the craziest and out there sneakers we find today here at the Nike clearance store, the Nike ZM Streak Spectrum Plus Premium. Regularly priced at $200, now going for $80. This upper is crazy. The pink, the purple, that glitch kind of pattern on the upper, and the flames on the side. These are, these are something. These are definitely out there. I really like these. Actually, I'm pretty sure Supreme did a collaboration with uh, Nike on these. They did like a fire print one, and I don't think they have much resale value, but these are cool, man. These are really, really cool. Really have like this vapor wave, cool kind of glitch vibe. I mess with these a lot. If I can find a pair in size 10, I honestly might have to snag these because these are such a unique shoe in my opinion. Yo, this is such a tease right now. You guys ever have that experience at the store where they have every size for the shoe you want, but it's not in your size? They have 9.5, they have 10.5, but no 10. This is a 10.5 of those Nikes I showed you guys earlier. They also have the 9.5, but I just can't seem to find the 10. I hate when this happens, man. They, they never have my size for the shoe I want. Has that ever happened to you? That's the common question of the day if you guys want to answer the Air Jordan 1 Gym Red giveaway. What was the last sneaker that you tried to buy, but they just didn't have your size? They had every other size higher and lower, just not the exact size you wanted. So I asked the employee about these, if they had a size 10 in the back and they don't. So I'm gonna give the size 10.5 a shot, show you guys what they look like on feet. Hopefully they fit, but uh, I mean 0.5 isn't that big of a deal. They feel good, they look good. Yep, I am definitely satisfied with the way these fit and how they look on feet, so it's gonna have to be a cop. So just crease the crease the ones for the one time. Ooh, now this. This is a really good find here at the Nike outlet. They have the Nike React Element 55 for $120 in the Gym Red colorway. The Nike Gym Red Nike React Element 55. It's retail price $175, now $120. I really like the way the white, the black, and the red really work together on this. Probably one of the best colorways of the Element 55 in my opinion. We have a small little like stain here on the upper. Not too sure about that, but still that $120 price point. Now we're into the size 10 section my size so I'm hyped to look at some shoes these are the same Nike Hirachi edge sneakers we saw earlier but this time in a black and blue colorway $50 for these bad boys and as I'm running around the outlet I just want to remind you guys they have a ton of sizes available for these right here the Air Maestro 2 LTDs these are size 9.5 they also have more of them here like there's just so many sizes available so if it's a shoe you like definitely swing by the outlet for these things these are pretty cool we got the uh, the Nike Vapor Max FK Utility size Size 10, regularly $300. Now these are going for $210 with that really, really comfortable Vapor Max sole. And this has a really unique upper. I'm not used to seeing this upper on a Vapor Max kind of shoe. Sort of reminds me of like a hiking kind of shoe. Don't know how I would wear these as a lifestyle sneaker. It sort of has these like tech wear kind of vibe. Oh, and that's cool. It also comes with a little uh, bag here too. A little, little carrying bag. Got some Air Force One low gray canvas right here. Going for $55, size 11. Pretty solid find for a daily beater, not too bad. They got the Vandal High Supreme Quickstrike Purple for a hundred bucks. The box is absolutely destroyed. Like it got ripped up by like a dog or something, but this purple, this purple really, really hits. In the size 11 selection, we have the Air Max Speed Turf for $75, down from 190. Definitely some big, 
gothic retro vibes from this shoe. I like this colorway. This is a really, really solid colorway. And the outlet today is absolutely littered with these. These are the Air Force Max right here with this crazy rainbow kind of knit upper. This looks like a performance basketball shoe, I want to say. With that full length air unit right there as well. These are going for $85 down from $210. Next up are the Air Jordan 33. I think this is the why not version of it. But this like sort of schematic blueprint kind of vibe going all over the place. Sort of gives off off-white vibes too with the orange, the green. Sort of looks like a deconstructed, reconstructed kind of vibe here. These are going for $170 and that Nike on the back, the Nike Air. Ooh, that looks really cool. And that Jumpman 2 also has that iridescent print as well. On to one of the final shoes for the day. We got the Air Force One Low Utilities and that neon yellow upper. These are crazy, crazy loud. And uh, they don't have the sell price on the box on it, so I don't know how much these are going for. But these are by far the loudest and brightest shoe here at the Nike Outlet. This next shoe I'm about to show you guys might be the biggest like price drop here at the Nike Outlet here today. $200 off on a pair of Air Jordan Retros. These right here used to retail for $500 plus tax. Now they're going for $300 plus tax. And these are a B grade, a B grade. So there's gonna be some factory flaws and there's gonna be some general ugliness on the shoe when you buy it. These are the Air Jordan 5 Pinnacles. And this is like the gray white colorway that they had, more of a gray colorway. And it looks a little dirty in my opinion. You have the premium leather upper, which is one of the reasons the price for this sneaker was so ridiculously high to begin with, but the quality on this is insane. The leather actually goes all the way down to the midsole, you guys can see here. So it's, uh, it's different. Not too many Air Jordan 5s actually have the leather or the upper of the shoe go all the way down to the midsole like that. The teeth are covered up, so it's gray on gray. And then actually on the tongue right here, you get some extra details with this like triangle little patch. And then you also have golden aglets right here on the premium laces. Now, again, these are a B grade, so there's gonna be some factory flaws, but I really think $200 is not enough for this to uh, go on sale. This is, oh, it even comes with a bag too. So that's pretty cool. But I mean, come on, $300 for these, that's gonna be a really tough sale, especially if you're here at the Nike outlet looking for steals. $300 for this is not a steal. Let me let me put these back right now. Yeah, these are crazy. The Nike Air Force One Jester Highs for $65. These are wild, man, with the misplaced everything. Oh my gosh. Now on to what might be the cheapest sneakers of the day for $39.99. We got these gray SFAF1 mids right here, regularly priced at $215. Now $40. This is a woman's size nine. They have a few other sizes. And then they also have the Nike NSW Gator Boot for $30, down from $300. 330. These boots right here are 90% off retail. That is absolutely insane. Holy cow. If you don't believe me, there's the price. 330 Canadian retail. Now, $29.99. This month, since we hit 300,000 subscribers, I figured we would give away one of my favorite pair of Air Jordans, the Air Jordan 1s, and they're gonna be in the gym red colorway, these bad boys right here. Perfect for summer, perfect for all year round. And to enter this giveaway, all you have to do is subscribe to this channel, Sneaker Talk, subscribe to my second channel, Sneaker Talk 365, my sneaker review channel, sneaker news channel, and follow me on Instagram, at Sneaker Talk CA. And then like this video and comment down below letting me know a sneaker that you tried to buy but they just didn't have your size. They had every size but your size. So just like what happened today. I still ended up buying those shoes but similarly uh, to what happened today. Anyways, you can also get some bonus entries this month by commenting and liking on any of the videos I upload during the second half of July. And also on the other channel, I'll be uploading some videos around there, which you can comment and like and uh, enter for these Air Jordan 1 Gym Reds. These will be a size 11. I also have a 10.5 available, but I'll, I'll uh, send over whatever is closest to your size. And if not, you can always sell it or you can trade it, do whatever you want with them. But I'll have a review on these bad boys up very, very soon. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Feel free to binge watch mine and uh, yeah, have an awesome weekend. Peace out.